Hello, and welcome again to another episode of Beaker Plays. And today we are back to playing the Doors of Trithius. Um, I know I did release, for those of you who are interested, there's a Core Keeper video now up on my channel as well, as we'll start that Core Keeper playthrough as well. But today we're continuing the adventures of our churro um, as we play through the Doors of Trithius. So where he last let off, let off um, we had done some wilderness exploring and then went back to town. So I think at this point we will just check the job board here and see what kind of um, uh, jobs are available. So let's see, we have a couple of unique ones here. Um, Bandit, Hunter, Confidential Matter. Ooh, I don't think I've seen that one before. And a Hunting Party, which I don't think we're ready to take on a behemoth. Gremlin Researcher, Baked Goods Delivery, and Restock. Ooh, I think we'll just do the Baked Goods one. Uh, those are always usually fairly easy. And we have eight days, so we need to find Theodric the Baker. So let's head down here. <coughs> and we found the shop here with the bread on it, so that's going to be our baker. So let's uh, borrow or steal, whatever you want to say, anything that's in the... Uh, the crates around here in this new town. And let's go talk to the baker. Looking for work. I'll need someone to deliver an item. Ask about delivery. I have a bundle of baked goods I need delivered to the Welvin to Welvin the civilian who lives in Northbury. The thing is, it's not safe on the road. The irresistible smell may attract looters. Ah, we'll try it. What the heck? All right. Let's see. What are we looking like here? How much gold do we have? I only have five gold. That's not going to do much. All right, let's head out, I guess. Oh, and that's somewhere we haven't even explored yet. Oh, this could be interesting. We are going to move cautious now. I would really like to... Oh! Oh, we went past it. There we go. All right, we have to find... Who do we have to find now? Welvin, the civilian. So let's first zoom out here. Where is the inn? Let's head to the inn first and see if he's there. Kind of hoping he's there or hanging around here. You're not Welvin, so nope. Nope. Westland, not Welvin. Um, loot everything we can. Arrows are always useful. Apples are good. Are you Welvin? Nope. Bandar, let's come down here to you. Nope, you're a guard captain. Where is the civilian? Mighty ogres. They have some of the strongest bones and make the best armor. I only take the bones of the ones who have passed on, of course. I'm not that heartless. Hmm. Bone split. Wow. Alrighty. All right, where is the civilian dude at? Need to find. Are you Welvin the civilian? Nope. You're the governor. Let's go back over here, though, because I don't steal stuff from his house, of course. You don't look like a civilian. It's going to be empty. All right. All right. Where is Welvin, the civilian? Of course, we'll loot everything we can while... Oh, and we're now overburdened. It's going to tell us our inventory is full. There are numerous ways to increase your maximum inventory and drop items. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We'll get back to fixing that problem later. Um, where is Welvin? Come here, Welvin, wherever you are. You're just a town guard. I think we already talked to you, didn't we? No, you're fine. Hmm. 
He's a civilian, so he shouldn't be any of those. Oops, I wonder if you're a well then. Nope, we're already in here. Don't mind us, we're just stealing all your stuff. Let's go all the way up, I guess, and start up here. Nope. Not well then. Not there. That one's locked. That's the governor. Where the heck is Welvin? Right? Welvin, the citizen. Where are you, buddy? We're looking for you. Alrighty. Well, this has been a lot harder than usual. Oh. That guy go. Nope, you're tearing. Well then, there, finally, we found him. I have some baked goods for you. Thank you, you have been waiting for this. You are welcome. Alright, now let's go back to our... Uh, Looting anything and everything we can find. So we'll zoom back in. Another bandage. That's always good. Cook some baked potatoes. Ooh, our level, our cooking level just went up. Let's go check our cooking in here. All right, we can get vegetable cutting or baking or mushroom. I think we're going to do baking next. So we can make some bread. Right. Oh, I was gonna look and see now that we we don't have any yeast. Not sure where to get yeast yet, but we already looted all those. Whoops, nope. Did we loot anything in here? Nope. I mean the townspeople are letting us borrow it without returning. We're nice, we don't loot anything. We don't steal anything. Before we go though, we are definitely gonna have to sell some stuff in this town. All right, here we go. Lots of stuff to loot. And I don't think we finished looting the other town either um, before we left. So we will have to go back there and make sure we get all that when we turn in our quest. Let's see what he has for trade. Oh, what can we sell him? Nothing here really weighs all that much, right? I think now we have looted everything. Let's go to the general merchant here. See what we can sell to the general merchant. All right, so. Let's go to scrolls first. We have two bone broths, we don't need both. Let's go ahead and do that really quick. Come over here. Uh, uh, so add the bone broth. Maybe. Requires alchemy skill. Huh. Okay. Add it to your recipe book. We already know that recipe. All right, so we can sell the bread recipe. So we already know how to do that. We are reading those. Let's see here. Nine bandages, even though it weighs quite a bit. I kind of just want to keep them. Rock 
food doesn't give us anything, we're just going to sell them all anyways. Because we don't need to handle that. Oh, we have a couple of cotton shirts. Not as good as our tunics selling. Already wearing old sandals. Um, I'll just sell an iguana tail for now. That's loot, that's loot. Saw all the lumps of coal. There we go. I got us back down at least under our over encumbered um, number there. And let's see how we're doing on our book. We're only 27% through our book. All right. Let's go see what quests we have in this town. Behemoth, hunted party, loot. Oh, hmm. It's unlimited, maybe we should just get that one. Oh, we can do that, advertising the grocer. Is that him? I assume this guy's the grocer, the food guy. Aha, yep. Let's do... He's looking for advertising. The easiest job in the world. Create an irresistible item. I need eight... Give away eight rare cabbages. I will help you. So, one. Two. Wow, with all these people out here, this is going to be super easy. Three. Four. Oh, you hate cabbage? Sorry, buddy. Five. Six, seven, hello, eight, there we go, that was about the easiest quest we'll probably ever do. We didn't even have to go into the inn or anything, they're just all out wandering around. There's your reward, yay, we got some gold. Let's see what, do we know that? We don't know the fresh salad recipe, let's buy it. Ooh, that's 76 gold. Eek. Um, you know what? I lied. Let's stop by that. All right. What was the other one we had? Um, unlimited. We need to look for Wesson, the adventurer. Not you. Not you. Well, then you guys have close names. You're an, he's actually an adventurer, so he's probably in the inn a lot of times. There we go. I need someone to retrieve my loot from a haunted cave. Why'd you leave it there? I hid a special item in a chest at Magest Magcester Hollow. When I went to retrieve it, the cave was full of gross. Oh no. Will you find? Yeah, I'll help. Luckily, it's a... It's ghosts, which aren't fun, but at least it's an unlimited quest, so we don't have to... Um, we're going cautious here. We don't have to wait and do it right away, at least. So that is good news. All right, back to Bardford. All right, let's see. We have to find the... Who was it that gave us this quest? The baker. Over here. There we go. Zoom back in. You can tell I zoom out in and out a lot here as we're uh, going through these towns. Delivered. Here's my reward. Yay. Ooh, we gained wisdom. No, you don't have no wisdom level. Let's actually come over... Where is it? Here. Quest reputation. In Bardford, we are still a stranger, but we're on our way. Hamlets. We're getting there. All right. Let's go find a bed. Locked. That means we should be able to get into this one over here. And a bed with nothing else. All right. We fall asleep. 
your dream that you are in a grand hall filled with people, all dressed in their finest clothes and attending a lavish feast. You sit down at the head table and are served a scrumptious meal, but as you take a bite of the roast chicken, you realize that it's raw and writhing with maggots. Yuck. All right, let's see. What do we want to unlock here? Um, kind of thinking about upping our reading, but wouldn't mind giving us alchemy either. Um, all right, what do we think? Alchemy or another level in reading? If we do that, we could start reading some of those, uh, reading the recipe for the bone broth. Yeah, we'll go ahead and do alchemy. Get a new skill unlocked. And then let's go find the potion. It's over here. There we go. Go find the potion vendor. So we can use his alchemy table. We cannot make anything yet. But let's read bone broth recipe. Which I know we can't make, but what is bone broth? Physical resist and cripple resist. Rogue's Toxin, Spider Fangs. Oh, I think I sold all my Spider Fangs. And, oh, we need to be able to do decoction. All right. Oh, now that I think about it, we should have a point to spend. Let's unlock that one there, because then we can make a recovery serum. Probably a bunch of them, too. There we go. I don't know if we necessarily need them, but it will... It got us all the way back up to level three, or yeah, three. So what does gives us bone broth? Rogue toxin needs sublimation. We have two. Do we have enough to make? No, we don't. Um. Let's just go ahead to do that one. All right, that used all of our points. Check out the board, restock for a meat pie. And nothing there I think we want to do right now. So it's time to go and loot stuff. See what he has for trade. So we don't have any gloves on right now. I think we might just buy the gardening gloves. They give us a chance for mushroom plant and flower um, harvest and physical resist of four. Which I think sounds really good for what we want right now. So let's just go ahead and equip those. And now that I looked at it, how are we doing on... Right, we're doing okay on all of our weapons. Everything's repaired. We got back some of our gold that we just spent, which is nice. We don't really need old sandals, but okay. There. You know what we're going to do? This may be dumb, but a bunch of raw potatoes. We're going to buy them, turn around here, and just cook a whole bunch of baked potatoes. How are we doing on cooking now? Oh, I didn't get us up to level five. Um, how much do we get back? Huh. We lost five, but that's okay. We got experience. So let's do that, and then let's buy the last baked potato for raw potatoes. There we go, that got us to level 5 of cooking. So now we can... Actually... Is there anything we need pan frying? So not really, because we don't have any... Oh, I see we only need raw meat, raw eggs. I think we'll do pan frying. Which was... Oh, maybe we can't. No, pan frying requires two. 
Oh boy. All right, we'll just wait. I think we'll just try to unlock pan frying when we're ready. And that one, a little bit of grinding here today and looting. We're looting two towns today. Let's see if he has. Oh, nothing we need. All right. Whoops, we missed a barrel. Got an apple. Come over here. I think we're just going to name this episode. I promise I'm not a thief or something like that. I promise we're not thieves. As we proceed to loot everything in town. It looks like we are now over encumbered again. Oh, huh. Not sure I've seen so many buildings with just a bed and nothing else in them before. Usually I have at least one other piece of furniture. Let's see what he has for trade. Anything we need? We need a, we would be nice to unlock chivalry, but we got a long way to go on that one. Um, we don't have enough for lantern anyways. I was looking to buy it. All right, let's see what we can get rid of here. We already have old sandals. Sell a couple apples. Uh, we don't probably need that many those don't need rotten food even though they don't give us anything yeah we'll get rid of that um, <laughs> rare cabbage is only worth five that much each gee thanks um, We don't need splitting axe. We don't need the shove. We really need the meat cleaver if we have the ceremonial blade that really does about the same with the same attack speed. I think we'll get rid of the meat cleaver. And that got us back down under our um our over encumbered threshold at least. For the moment before we go and uh borrow some more stuff from these people. Is this the tailor, I'm guessing? The clother. Padded hood. I don't know what we need there. Sorry, buddy. Just came and stole your stuff. That's it. Just needed your stuff. So if you're watching these videos, what do you think of the game so far? Put a comment and let me know what you think. Um, like I said, I think it's a great game. It is a bit grindy. Like right now, I'm, well, I'm grinding. You probably don't have to, but, um, I'm trying to last as long as I can. So I'm trying to grind and loot everything, you know, Skyrim style, um, loot everything we can to try to make us last and not die. Um, and keep our churro alive for a while so we don't have to start over. Cause ideally I'd like to not start over until... 
one of the next versions of the game comes out and it's an, a breaking change. Every now and then they do release, um, since this is an early access, a version will come out and it'll break. Be a breaking change where you can't really keep your live stuff or your previous save. Um, so I kind of like to try to keep this, keep our churro alive until we hit that point, but we will see. Don't have a very good track record of it. And we are not going to, if we die, we die. We're not going to reload a save. It's just how it works. So let's go over here to the end. Yeah. And I'd like also to give a shout out to those of you who have left me comments on the videos or give me that thumbs up. Um, to like the video that's helps the channel hopefully get get a few more views to get some exposure to these games I'm not really in it for views or anything um, just playing the games I want to play and hopefully give exposure to them as we as they make it along their journey in the early access especially for this one so let's see here I don't know if there's anything else I really want to do here so let's come out of there. Oh wow, that one quest is all the way up there. Um, what's that town? Kelna? You know what, I'd say let's try, let's head up here. And we're gonna rest to get rid of our travel weariness. Okay. So now our travel weariness is back at zero because we're going to be going across some wilderness here. Let's actually go there. Let's explore it. Danger is very low. That's good. We like very low. And right away we have something. We have a scorpion. Eek. Right away. And spiders. So much for very low. Jeez. Uh, we have to run. Oh boy, uh, we are in trouble. Okay, we got rid of Scorpion. Okay. That was close. Ten. We have to take an antidote right now. And we... Well, let's eat a boiled egg. Oh, geez, there's another scorpion and a wild. Gee, many Christmas. Someone thought it said the uh, danger level was very low. I'm going to call bull honky on that. We're going to jump. Try to get out of that um, wild turkey's view. And we hit space here for a while. Um, to use a baked potato. There's that wild turkey again. We're going to jump. Oh, shoot. You made it over here. I was holding space a little too long. Eek. Okay, we got to take a bandage right now. And let's loot that. Let's eat an apple. And I think we're going to let, wow, it said very low, right? I mean, I'm not mistaken, right? And yet we're just, we haven't even really made it out of anything yet. Okay, we're going to jump. I want to stay away from that wild turkey. Oh, geez. Another scorpion. All right. All right, we are going to escape, just barely. And we are heading straight into town. Whew. That was maybe a mistake, I don't know, that was crazy. For a very low danger, we pretty much just got accosted by enemies right away. We need to find, well, we have a wisdom level, so let's just go find somewhere to sleep because I think that'll refill all of our missing hit points. 
This guy should have a bed. Yep. All right. We're going to deep sleep. This time. Let's unlock botany. I'm trying to get some of these skills unlocked. So maybe as we're doing things, uh, we'll go ahead and level them up. So, all right, new town. What town are we in here? Kalna. So we're going to loot three towns today. I mean, not loot. Uh, find items that were left on the ground. That's what we'll go with. All right, we need to repair our padded cap. We have plenty of things for it. Oh, do we find, we have an extra peasant's cap? We do, we'll just break that down. We don't need a peasant cap. Get the leather. All right. We're just looking in the lost and found in these stores. That's what we're gonna call it. I like that idea better than them giving us stuff. This is all lost and found items. Just assuming it's been there for quite a while, so no one cares if we borrow it. General store, let's see what he has to trade or what he wants of ours. Nothing too much there. Oh, we'll sell the parchment for a whole one gold. Does he have any recipes or anything we don't have? Nope. All right. This isn't quite what I was planning on doing today, but three towns, three towns worth of free items, and I'm not going to turn that up, down. What I don't know is if they resupply after so long. Might be a question I need to ask on the um, developer Reddit is if the, uh, if the towns put stuff back in their uh, quote unquote lost and found for me to find. Or is this a one time looting that we can do? Whoops, we don't need to do that. And the guards just all stand by while I steal all their stuff. Oh, sweet. We found a uh, another study. Where are we at? We're at 83%. Getting close on that. All right. So if we get that book done while we're here. 83.6. I don't know if it will or not while we're here. We're in town. If it'll continue studying while we're in town or not. Doesn't seem like it is. Hello everyone at the end. And we're over on Cumbert again. That's okay. We'll handle it before we leave. We made it everywhere yet. Let's see it pan around here. Whoops. Pan. Nope. We have not made it over here. Let's run. Let's check out the job board as we run by here. More the other quest would be nice. Um Bandit Hunter hunting party for Behemoth. No, thank you. 15 leather. We should see if we have it. Cobble casserole. Where are we at on leather? We only have eight. So hoping maybe we had 15 and we could just uh take the quest and complete it right away, but we do not. Let's see, maybe he sells. Nope. Offhand weapon. Right now we have dodge, but it's physical resist six. Do we want to use a... Why can't I talk to this guy again? Okay, I don't know if you guys are seeing this, but my cursor is not... Oh! No, we did not want to do that. Yeah, I'm sorry, buddy. I did not mean to do that. Hmm. 
No. No. We screwed up. And we... Oh, we can't jump because we have no movement. Alright, we gotta drop something. Drop. And let's drop. Eek, we'll drop that. Still not there. Wow, we made a huge mistake. Alright. Why can't I jump? Your movement is hampered. Why is my movement hampered? We're back under. I'm confused, guys. We are under capacity. What am I missing? There, now we are. Alright, we're running. Will he keep following us? Let's see if we can jump again. I have to try to get out of his range. It's going to take us a while, though. Still cannot escape. All right. And this is going to take a while. We are not gaining any ground on him. How is he gaining up on us? Oh, because we are hungry, I'm guessing. Oh, well, I hope I didn't just make a mistake. Come in here. There. It still says there's enemies in the area. Damn. There, we got out. Ooh, wow, that was a huge mistake. And we somehow made it through. Oh my goodness. Let's see if we go back in if he's still after us. Hopefully he's not. Wow. I did not want to kill that guy. Huh. All right, we are getting out of here. I don't know where that guy is. Hopefully he's not still mad at us. It does not look like it. Do it in trips, friend. Whew. All right. That was interesting. And it's all because I was clicking on the wrong person and then tried to move into him. There should be an option to, like, not attack village people. Drugs, toxin, paralysis, quake. Ooh, all right. I, my heart is beating out because we're racing, I guess, not beating. It's always beating. Because I thought for sure we were going to die there. Or I thought the town guard were going to come after us and we were just going to be in big trouble. All right, we need to get rid of two pounds of inventory. Let's see, what are we going to get rid of here? Cotton shirt is one. Oh, and we have the... I think we still have coal, don't we? Did we drop that somewhere else? Lump of coal. We still have three of those. All right, so let's go... Let's head back to the general store and see if he'll buy our lump of coal.
you will. So that gets us back under. And then we don't need a cotton shirt either. All right, there we go. Ooh, back under. We did not get much accomplished today, but it's almost the end of my lunch break. We did loot some cities, I guess. Um, so that is about it. Um, yeah, not what I thought we'd get done today at all. I thought we'd actually find some... I guess we did get one quest done. We Or two quests. We did some advertising, and we delivered some rare... Or no, we got the rare cabbage from advertising, didn't we? I don't remember now. Anyways, and we del made a delivery, so we got a little bit done. We gained a level. Uh, let's see if we have any other focus points to spend, because we unlocked... Oh, yeah, we unlocked botany, but don't have anything there, which is where I was trying to get to in when we went to that very low risk uh, wilderness exploration and almost died there too. Um, I was hoping to get some plants there, but that did not happen. When I was going to check, where are we at on our book? 89%. So hopefully next episode we will finish with our book studying, get a level there, hopefully maybe. Um, do we have anything that lets us read a level two? Nope. We have we gotta find some more. Um, oh, we can sell a bread recipe. Sweet. Um, yeah, and maybe we'll get some quests here we can use as well. So, um, sorry for that. Not very. Uh, well, I say not very exciting, but we almost died. So, um, yeah, I guess it kind of was exciting. Almost lost our whole game. So. Thank you for watching another episode of Beaker Plays and going along with us on our journey of our churro. Uh, if you like what, you, the, what you've what you been seeing here of the game, remember it is available on Steam Early Access. There's a link in the show description. Um, it's not an affiliate link or anything. It's just a link straight to Steam, so not getting anything out of it. Um, so... Just if you like what you're watching, also hit the like and subscribe buttons so you can be notified when new episodes are available. And also leave me a comment it, or suggestions for the channel um, as we're trying to get this channel off the ground here. Positive and negative comments are appreciated. Uh, when I say negative, I guess I mean constructive uh, comments are appreciated. So until next time, happy gaming, everybody.